what is up everybody back again it's the dude the rebel the guy steps in next level mr keen sergeant aka geek dude dude rebel level 92 sergeant crazy and of course ha <laughs> k dog welcome back here on keenan's key clip number six that's right we have reached our sixth episode now as you seen on my last clip that we was talking about the n64 once again, my favorite system of all times. Hopefully some of you guys have some. Hopefully you guys uh, might get some too because I know a couple places to get it. So, um, yes, like, was, like I said, we've talked about it. Uh, great console for anybody. So now we're going to be introducing the games. And for the first one, uh, this is actually, I'd probably say maybe second to favorite or whatever. But anyways, now you guys play Gran Turismo. You guys play Need for Speed. Y'all used to play a game called Pro ACM. But, none of that compares to the game that I always like to play. Star Wars Episode One Racer. Get with your boy. Yes, that is right. The Star Wars game for the N64. This is Racer Mode. Great game. Loved it. I used to play this a whole lot. Um, yes, yeah, sold it once. Thank God I actually uh, got it back from a Slackers for almost three bucks. I love that place. Um, first off... Big fan, really big fan of Star Wars. You know, I've seen all six. I heard they come up with a seven, but then people keep saying it's going to suck for some reason. I don't know. We got to witness it to find out. But anyways, big Star Wars fan. I love Star Wars. I even got like a couple of uh, wristbands, a key linear, and I even have a Stormtrooper jacket and it still fits. It looks nice. But this game right here, this is... So, of course, you know, basically this is after the uh, number one, the... Re the 21st century or 21st century number one and uh there was a scene in there when it was Saboba and Anakin Skywalker in that uh racetrack so probably after the movie they was like okay you know what after that why don't we make a game to uh why don't we make a game of Star Wars but have it in the racing part all right bought it I played it once I remember I loved it they have a whole this thing has a whole lot of racing if I can name them all and I probably show it to you on the game uh system but in there you have Anakin, you have uh, Anakin Skywalker, you have Clegg Holfast, E.B. Endicott, Gasgano, uh, Mars Woe, Dub Bolt, uh, Rats Tyrell, Eli Mock. Of course, you got Sebulba. Um, other characters like Toy Damter, Sly, Sly, it's Sly something, something with a P. But um, you have. Temp, you have a guy named Temto, you have Bulls War, Mahonic, Eldar, Beto, um, uh, what else, who else is on there? Uh, Fudge Sang, Bullseye, Navar. Uh, you have that one guy with the last, the last name is like really hard to pronounce, uh, Bang, Quasi, Quasi something. Um, but my favorite one on here is O.D. Mandrell. Who, do I, do I know why? No, I don't. Who cares? Oh, well. But, um, yeah, this, so it's like it's a whole it's a whole lot of races on here. Um, and you think like I see I seen the movie. I mean, I looked at it. I was like, okay, cool. They're on the game. Uh, Fudge saying Rhett, not Fudge, yeah, Fudge saying and um, who I say Bullseye Navar. Uh, they were not in the movie. They were just creating the game. I think along with some others, but um, I'll try to get that later. But um, the one thing that made this game also unique is that they have every track or they have they have every uh setting scene you know like from the original racetrack when it was just that desert uh there's the cloud city there's the murky swamp they have all that in there and uh of course the track now of course uh in every track there might be it might be one in one now the thing is it's the same it's the same track but they uh map it different there's some there's some roads on there or there might be like some paths are the same but uh granted or less they uh um, Add, they either like add more or take less out, and then they, uh, like I said, they try to divert into something new. The I believe the only track that stayed the same was the um, one in the movie. There's there's no other one, but um, there's the uh, I think I think if I'm right, there's the uh, one where Luke Skywalker and the rest of the uh, troops were finding those uh, giant camels, and it was kind of like that snow part. That's probably in, that's in there. Like I said, the swamp. Uh, Cloud Cities, and, yeah, some of Cloud Cities in there, and there's only there's like one state in here that I like so much. It's um, 
Toy is Toy Adapter and Fuss saying they are the uh, track favorites and they're not like, different levels. But um, <clears throat> it's a part. It's a part in that stage. We'll probably see when we get to the game. I'll probably do like two stages or something. But um, but in that stage, there's like a big tunnel and it's, I call it I call it a gyro tunnel because it's like it's like anti gravity. You know, you're like flowing right in the middle of it and whatever. And uh, you can do like so many turns. I always speed through there. And then the thing is. Uh, once one of the stage, I picked the Tordanthum one, but it's a part where you like pop out of the ground, and then if you still have the boost on, and you like slam to the ground, your engine's gonna uh, explode. So just be careful on that part, even when you're going in. Uh, like I said, which I did during the game, but yeah, that's my favorite stage. And the one thing I like about this, you know, it's not like really other racing games because unlike uh, Nat, like I said, NASCAR or um, Gran Turismo. Or, um, what I say, Need for Speed. Now, those, you know, of course, those are just cars. And if you crash, you know, you just crash or get a wrecked car. But this one, you can, um, your engine can blow up and then you can respawn in, uh, like a couple more seconds. And, like I said, there's a whole lot of racers in this game. You know, you guys should play. If you haven't played it, I suggest play it. It's real fun. Bring some friends over. You have a blast. Um, also, another, another game similar to, oh, no, first off. Um, after this came out, when the PlayStation 2 era was coming in, uh, they actually brought this game back, and that was Star Wars Racers Revenge. Um, it still, ha it still has some of the, uh, characters in there. I still, still use Odin Mandrell either way. I don't know why, he's just cool to me. But, um, yeah, he's in there. Uh, I think the, I think it's an older Anakin, I believe. Either that or still the young one. But, uh, yes, yeah, he's still in there, so Bulba's going to be in there. Um, yeah, so that's about it. And that Ben Quasadores, I don't know what his, I'd say his last name, but it's real hard. Also, they also have a, um, if you go to a, a local arcade, you know, they got a, uh, Star Wars race in there, too. I played it a lot. It's kind of, it's kind of hard steering, you know, like, you you hold down, you, if you hold down on the, um, left hand of bar, you're going to go left, and, of course, you hold down right, you're going to go down right, and then you also have the boost button. But, um, another thing is, another game that was similar to this, you probably guys know it, it was, um, F-Zero. And if you don't know what that game is, if y'all remember the driver, Captain Falcon from Super Smash Brothers, he controlled the, um, I want to say Blue, I want to say Blue Falcon, but, um, uh, it's the Blue Ride. It was him, Dot Stories, and other characters in there. But anyways, you know, they're both, these are both, like, futuristic, scientific type games, um, you know, it, it's fun. Like I said, it's not like your regular racing game. It's, uh, futuristic. You all driving hover cars. These are, uh, if you look, pod, they're pod racers. They're basically like jet, double jet type engine. And then you got your little cockpit over there. And of course, right here, the, uh, cable is basically a lightning, like lightning strikes. It's kind of awesome. Wish we had that in the real world. So without further ado, we... Now, also, uh, just for a reminder, this here has actually two intros. You got this one with Anakin, and then there's another one. Um, you can turn it back on. You can turn it back on again. I ain't gonna try because it's gonna take like one of the tries. But uh, of course, you have some Boba coming in with the other racers. Let's get this. Up. Also, thanks to George Lucas for actually making the movie. First off, and of course, you have your tournament here. That's your racing stuff. You got free play, you got time to Let's go to tournament. So you see it takes place in the bar and there's a uh, pit joy. It's kind of weird how they walk though, man. I'm gonna give me one of those. So there's your bo my boy, Odin Madrell. Let's go down and see the characters. Of course you got your star player, Anakin Skywalker, Tinto, Pigalis, or however you say it, Rastarel, Eldar Beto, Mahonic, Art Bumpy Rose, I forgot about that guy. Wayne Sundage, Mars Woe, Evie Endicott, Dub Bolt, Gasgano, Clay Holfast, Elon Mock, Neva Key, Bulls Roar, my boy Odie, Butt Sang, Sly Hat Pyramida, Toy Dampter, and Bullseye Navarre. And of course, there's going to be uh, more racers in here once I uh, finish the game, hopefully. But, uh, Oops. Okay, 
So here's the tracks. Uh, Tatooine, that's from the, that's exactly from the first movie. Um, these other stages, I, I'm not really sure, but I'm, I'm, like I said, I think this one is still, uh, from that at, at scene, whatever, when, it, when Luke, uh, tripped one of them. Uh, I think that's also part of the Sky City. Uh, don't know what that is. That's the stage I like. Um, and of course you got more stages over here. Uh, yeah, and here's the, uh, Swamp one. Uh, I think that's another, I think it's another part of the Sky City. Again, like I said, I don't know exactly where they are, but, you know, once again, all these stages are in the movie. And you got like four, uh, sir, you got four circuits. You got the Amateur, that's the Semi-Pros, Galactic, and the, uh, Invitational. That's it. That's all that. So, uh, we're just gonna go to our practice real quick. And right here, so right here you have your, on the bottom right, that's your uh, track favorite. And on the top, those are your uh, record holders. And on the side, it shows uh, if you win whatever place, you get like a certain amount of uh, money or something, what they call it. So start with the race. And first off, if you uh, keep going like this while you press A, there's actually something cool in there. I don't know if it's cool or not, but you also got a spec vehicle. Upgrade, buy parts, go to the junkyard, buy pit droids, and change vehicle. And of course, you got options. But let's uh, start the race. Via Pop Gusta. Mr. Gamagudo Pachi Kisa Dopa. If only I knew how to talk like that. <laughs> This may be the future of Padre's racing, folks, so take a good look. No cable! Let's hear the race. Now, of course, once again, like I said in the last video, you know, uh, 64-bit, good. This right here is actually the first start of the game. Like, a fish, like a fish. Trash talk. You don't even know what they're saying, but you know they're talking some shit. Yeah, so it's a like I said, good amount, good amount of players on here. Uh, nifty, nifty tracks. But like I say, you gotta be careful. Now on this game, you gotta be careful with your turn because these are like tight. So you gotta be careful not to uh, wreck your engine unless you uh, use that booster pack. And I advise you not to use the booster pack when you turn. So, there you have it, Star Wars Racers, Episode 1. Of course, once again, it's front based off the uh, 
first first movie. Uh, like I said, it was a great game. Uh, still great today. Uh, it's kind it's kind of hard, you know, trying to uh, get first place because once you once the uh, the stage you're on, if it's like a new racer that's not in your uh, selection, that's of course going to be a new racer. If you win, you get there. You get them. Like I said, my favorite one of all time is always going to be Odie. He's awesome. Uh, yeah, so there you have it for today. So, my next clip, um, I'm trying to find a good game on that one. I only got like four. So, hopefully, I will get more games. But once again, uh, like and comment on the video. Once again, you can find me on Facebook, Kingdom Sergeant. You can find me at uh, facebook.com slash kdoff55. My Facebook name is Kingdom Sergeant. I also got Instagram and uh, Twitter. On Twitter, I got do level 92 That's all capital letters on do and then capital V, 92. Instagram, do level 92 all lowercase. Uh, once again, like and comment, and I will see y'all whenever I want to see y'all again. Peace out.